Hello, I'm Christian Fraser. You're watching Context on BBC News. Are we sleepwalking towards a new war in Europe? The United States believes the threat of conflict in Ukraine is real and could come at any moment. The US Secretary of State, Antony Blinken, is on his way to Kiev. He'll meet with Sergei Lavrov on Friday as Moscow rejects fresh talks with Ukraine. The changing shape of the UK workforce. 400,000 people have left the labour market since the beginning of the pandemic, with vacancies now at a record high. The man who held a Jewish congregation hostage in a Texas synagogue this weekend was on a terror watch list here in the UK. Tonight, with all the context, the Democratic strategist Marianne Marsh and Geeta Harry, former advisor to Boris Johnson. Welcome to the programme. The US senators who travelled to Kiev Monday to meet President Zelensky believe the threat of a Russian invasion is significant, immediate, and Ukraine needs to be ready for the worst. Senator Chris Murphy from Connecticut, one of seven senators who travelled, said it would be the most significant disruption to the post-Cold War political order in Europe since the conflict ended 30 years ago. No one is entirely sure whether Vladimir Putin has made the final decision, which explains the shuttle diplomacy now unfolding. The US Secretary of State has just left Washington for a meeting with President Zelensky tomorrow, ahead of four-way talks with France, Germany and the UK on Thursday, and then on Friday, crunch talks in Geneva with the Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov. Here's the NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg speaking just a few hours ago. 